Hi, boys and girls. It's Miss Kramer. I wanted to show you the ladybug habitat. Oh, something's happening right here. I see that one moving. And he's looking a little bit longer than the other ones. This is the one we were looking at the other day who was all white. Remember that one? Or all tan? Let me move it here so we can kind of see what this guy's doing. Oh, very long. Longer than the other ones. The other ones look very short. Let's see what's going on there. Oh, he's wiggling. I can see him wiggling. This guy right here. And he's got like a tan shell at the bottom that I don't see anybody else having. It's really hard to see through this habitat. See what he's doing. Yeah, he's definitely doing something. He's like wiggling his little legs. See right this one right here. I can see him moving his legs. Can't tell exactly what he's up to. What are you doing, little ladybug? I apologize that um, it's a little hard to see. Yeah, and even with my own eye, I can't really tell what he's doing. It's definitely longer than the other ones, like a lot longer. I'm trying to show you so you can see what's going on there. This one right there. Looks like there's a... Looks like the ladybug's at the bottom and he's climbing out of something that he's leaving on the top. I think he's leaving his pupa. I think the pupa's on the top and he's actually climbing out the bottom. Because he looks like a ladybug climbing out the bottom. This part looks like a ladybug. And this part just looks like black. And there's his like leg stuck behind. I think he just came out of his pupa. How cool is that? See how he's climbing out of this like shell up here? That part's still attached to the habitat right there by the tail. And he just climbed out. Everyone say, ta-da! <laughs> Look at that. The ladybug just climbed out of his pupa. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. That's the first one. Say, so you're the first one. That is so cool. So actually, his shell is a tan, that same tan color that his, um, that his pupa was, that little, that little tan um, uh, sleeping bag that he climbed into. So there you go. Look at that. He just emerged out of his pupa. This one back here. See, the camera's focusing on the wrong thing. Right here. This guy right here. Let's see if I can get it to focus. Nope, I don't want that one. I want this one back here. Right there. How about that? Welcome to the world. Huh, that's pretty amazing. I'm glad I was videoing at that time. That's pretty neat. He left his little pupa case behind. So everybody else is still in their little pupa case. And they're going to crawl out. So today's Friday. So he's actually a, he's the first one because it didn't start until Saturday. So you can kind of see the legs are still, or whatever those things were, they must be legs, still attached to that pupa case up here by the tail. And now he's emerged, he actually has six legs. So one, two, three, I can see on this side. And if I can turn it, I can see them through on the other side. So that's my little sticky note so I know. There you are. Hello. So. One, two, three. Oh, it's hard to see. <laughs> no, I can see three. One, two, three. I can see five. I just can't see his third, his sixth leg. So apparently uh, his um, or her shell is soft right now. So what they do is they just sit and allow that uh, shell to harden. And his spots or her spots actually come later. So, um, 
Hmm, that's pretty neat. That was, that was pretty amazing. So this is the this is the pupa that he climbed out of, or she climbed out of, and we actually watched him climb out. That's so cool. Um, so now I'm supposed to soak raisins in water, which I'll do now for a couple minutes, and then cut them in half, and then the ladybug will have something to eat. And as soon as um, all the friends are are out, I will uh, I will release them. Wow, that is super cool. Be good, be well.